what I'm going to do is I'm going to go ahead and turn the system on. I'm going to go through the, the step up. This is a little step back. We're not doing barcode rating here. This is very similar to what you would achieve uh, on the shop floor. If somebody prints a job, they'll, they'll, they'll print a, uh, a registration mark. This is what an operator uh, would end up doing. They would pull their job up. Okay. In this case, we, we loaded the, the material. I'm going to go ahead and have the system kind of a, a, a neat feature here. I'm going to have the system, it's going to go ahead and look for the next mark. It's going to automatically stop once it finds that mark. Boom. There we have it. Found the mark. Okay. Now I'm ready to go ahead and start the system. The system knows where, where the material is at. Reinitializes itself. Now the operator, all the operator has to do is press the button. It's going to be die cutting. So we take a, a nice look at, at, at the laser field and what we're doing here. All this geometry is being cut with high speed galvanometers. We're running at speeds in excess of 10,000 millimeters per second. Not quite sure if you can see it. We're actually cutting a star. If you take a look at your, your, your pamphlet, there's a star there. I, the refresh rate of this TV isn't even quick enough to pick up that star being cut. That's how quickly we are moving this technology. This is where Spartanix, as, as being a solution provider, we are not only the developers of, of the equipment, we're developers of the software. Okay, we take a look at the hardware, the hardware is half the story. Software is what makes this hardware hum. This is what makes the hardware sing. It's singing right now. Why don't you just take, take a look at this for a second. And what I'm going to show you is, okay, fine, you have the artwork here. How does the laser know where to start? Okay? How does the laser know how to be efficient? And I'm going to talk about that in just a second with, with our optimization software. Okay. While the system is running, I'm going to come in into the software. I'm going to come into some of our laser settings. Those sharp edges that, it, that you see in, in that example of it, and I want you to take a look at the, at the Spartanix example. You take a look at your, uh, your sample. Down here is, is where, uh, where you have text that will actually tell you which sample is removed. I want you to take a look at that sample. Look at the sharp edges. The optimization tools that Spartanix gives you is a very, very, very simple tool that we provide. It's a sharp edges. Now if I told you what we all did there, I'd let the competition know what we're actually doing. I'm not going to do that, but I'm going to tell you right now, as, as developers of software and as developers of laser die cutting, we know what it takes in order to achieve a sharp edge without burning through the line of the interior. 